going on, family? Support me, big. Welcome back to my Black Universe. So you know what time it is. It's time to review the Nagash Skeezer sneakers. So let's get straight into it. So the first things first is on the site they say, hey, order a size down. These run a little bit bigger. And I lie. These are running a little bit bigger. So I wear a size 13. These feel like a size 14, so they were feel real plush. Um, I know it's a weird term for a sneaker, but they did. They feel real plush, very comfortable. But if you want a snugger fit, <laughs> you want a snugger fit, <laughs> I'd give them a size down. All right, you can't go wrong with that. So one thing to note I like about these shoes, the fact that even though they do get dirty, as you can see, these are actually a little dirty right now, they clean up well. Right, they clean them very well. They're actually fairly fairly easy to clean. And they actually, even though they get dirty, they don't get dirty that fast. I did a lot of walking over the course of several days, several weeks, just to, you know, put the paces in and then make it do what it do. Because I was like, you know, I want people to know, hey, like, if you're spending this type of money, you want to make sure these are quality shoes, and these are. And especially for all whites, because we know typically all whites, you get a, a serious scuff or a stain, and it's a wrap. Like, the shoe, you, you can't. It's not, it don't have the same effect, right? It don't have the same look. It don't have the same feel. So to know that these were not getting as dirty, it's easy to clean up, that was dope. So I'm loving that part of it, that aspect of it. The quality of the shoe, right? Like, nothing's faded off the back, as you can see right there. The Iron Horse is not faded off on the back on either one of them. You can wear it with jeans, shorts, you know, etc. And they still gonna hold up, right? You're getting what you're paying for. The gold Deshka crown that's sitting here at the top of the tongue of the shoe is dope. Now, inside the shoe, and I kind of expected that, if you look at the tongue, uh, that gold pattern that was on there and from the unboxing video, it's pretty much gone. But, you know, these shoes, you're wearing them, you're rubbing up against them, the friction, that constant friction between your socks and stuff. And yeah, these are not as, as pretty white as they were when I first got them. But hey, I wear my shoes, so. And no, I've not worn them barefoot. Uh, so, if you're looking for a nice pair of all whites, with quality, look dope, and you want to support a black-owned business, you can't go wrong with the cash. They've been around for a long time. They started before I didn't even knew who they were when I bought my first pair of uh, Hotep's back in 2016 to now and they're still going strong with new designs new looks things that uh the kids can uh get behind that are popular and let me say this for those who got an issue with the pricing because they're not quote unquote jordans or nikes remember we made those brands what they are they didn't make us so we can make these brands household names as well that's all i gotta say peace and Black Empowerment. Hit the link below.